Hi, I'm Jay Shaisuk-Siri, Product Specialist, IQS. Today I'm going to talk about Toolsnet rework. So what happens when we assemble a product incorrectly? We should make it right the first time, but if not, we have to push the product to the end of the production line and rework it later, because the production has to keep running. When a product is pushed to the end of the line for rework, we need more time for rework. And do we have a bunch of defective products? And there are other factors as well. Are results written on paper or recorded in the system? Are operators trained doing it right or they're just doing it by instinct? What if I told you that we could rework anywhere with the existing data? How? The assembly we have today will have a data that will mismatch in the program batch. The logic is if you have a batch of six bolts here and five was okay, one was not okay, so it means we have to rework this product. When the product is pushed to the end of the line for rework, it's simple. You just scan the product VIN number, tools that rework will populate your operator instructions, and it will select the program for you. As an operator, I just need to follow the instructions on the screen. I don't need any training. I just put on my operator hat and start working right away. So that's a bolt I need to repair. And data is collected back to Toolsnet, so it's 100% traceable. Toolsnet rework could be a classic end-of-line solution to rework your product. But in this case, we're showing an example of a mobile cart. It's a software, so it's super flexible. You could also install Toolsnet rework on an ST pad with an ST wrench. And you could do your rework anywhere in the production line. Or it could be used as a quality gate check. Imagine your customer has to put a cover on this and assemble more parts. That's a lot of disassembling and it costs a lot. So Toolsnet Rework could save you a lot of money and it's a flexible solution. Toolsnet Rework ensures flexibility, traceability, and it can save you time and money. If you have further questions, please contact your Atlas Copco representative. Thanks for watching.